So the development of TKI continues, and we're seeing more and more study of a novel allosteric inhibitor by the name of Asiminib, or formerly known as ABLE001. We have pretty long experience with that compound in the phase one trial, which has been presented and not published yet, but should be soon, showing that we have now a fourth generation TKI that's helpful for patients with resistance or intolerance to multiple other TKIs, um, a good safety profile, and a novel mechanism of action which allows us to probably combine it with other TKIs. So now we're ready to move on. And in order to better study this drug, um, we're presenting the schema and um, hopefully we'll soon have data for a randomized trial of Asiminib or ABLE001 compared to Basutinib for patients that have had two other therapies and essentially a similar population resistance or intolerance to prior therapy. This is a still an unmet need because many patients have trouble either gaining response or being able to manage uh, over the long term on certain TKIs. And, um, we don't have a lot of options in the third line setting. Um, Basutinib is a demonstrated option. Panantinib is an alternative. Some might ask why not compare to Panantinib. Um, I think we have different label and different uh, expectations for where to use Panantinib. So this trial I think is a good fit and hopefully we'll learn something soon.